Hey guys, it's me, Sydney. So we can't deny that new lip trends are everywhere. It's all about dimension and texture when it comes to lip products. Today I'm going to be showing you three different ways to play with texture on your lips using the Mellow Cosmetic Liquid Lip Paints. So the first trend that I'm going to be showing you guys how to do is the Glitter Lips trend. To achieve this, I'm going to be taking the shade Puerto Rico from the Globetrotter Trio. This is what the color looks like and I'm just going to start by lining my lips with the applicator and then filling them in. So this color goes on really smooth, but it dries to like a really matte velvety finish. These liquid lip paints are the perfect base for this glitter lip trend because they're long wearing so they're not going to go anywhere. Okay, so you want to apply the glitter while your lip is still a little bit wet so that it has something to adhere to. If you want, you can go over it with a little bit of a lip gloss to even help it stick more, but I'm just going to go in while the product is still a little bit wet and take some glitter on my finger and just tap it on. So I'm just taking a glitter that I got from Hobby Lobby. And I like this glitter a lot. You can use more defined glitter, but it does get everywhere, like it gets in your teeth and all that. I like this glitter because you can take it off easily and place it a lot easier. Alright you guys, so this is the end of this trend. As you can see, it's really easy to create. You just want to make sure that you let the glitter completely dry on your lips before moving around to prevent it from falling off. For this lip look, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a metallic finish. To do this, I'm going to be using the shade Paris from the Globetrotter Trio. So I'm just going to start by applying this color into the center first and then lining after. So red lip colors tend to stain. So I want to be really careful not to get it anywhere that's not my actual lips. So I'm just going and filling it in first so I can carefully line my lips afterward. To create the metallic lip chin, I'm just going to be layering a metallic lip shade over this color. And you can still see this color underneath, but it'll just look sparklier and shinier. Sparklier is not a word. So to create the metallic lip, I'm just going to be applying a metallic lip cover over top and you'll still be able to see this color underneath, but it'll just look more sparkly. So as you can see, adding that color on top just enhances the Paris color underneath and gives it a more foiled effect. I really like it. It's pretty. This will be a good Valentine's Day look. Next, I'm going to be showing how to do a metallic ombre lip using the liquid lip paint from Mellow Cosmetics in the shade Tokyo. Okay, so I'm just going to start the same way, just lining my lips with the product. You can use a liner with these, but they don't really move, so you, it's not necessary. So this is what the color looks like on its own. Now I'm going to go in with a metallic gold shade and apply that just to the center of my lips to create the ombre effect. So now I've applied the lighter shade in the center, I'm just going to go back in with the darker shade and just shade in some of the areas where the light got too far. I really like this a lot, it came out really pretty. All right, that's it for these three different lip looks. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and you learned something. Please comment below what your favorite lip look was and I'll see you next time. Bye.